a lot of homeless people, we don't eat a lot at all. Like, maybe once a day if we're lucky, and it's not a lot, it's probably like something somebody found in the dumpster behind Brooklyn or some, something that somebody gave them that's a house kid, but they already ate over there, so they don't want it, so they're trying to pass it on to somebody else. Something somebody finds. The food bags that come out. I mean, there's people that drive around with sack lunches in their cars and they give them out to us. That helps so much. You, you don't even know. It helps so much. There's people at Stone Park that do it. There's there's all kinds of feeds, but there's just not enough. Like, there's not enough anything really, I know, you know? There's not enough places to shower. I mean, I had friends, so I was lucky. There's, there's not enough of like, you know, anything like hygiene products because you go through them or you lose them or stuff gets stolen or the cops burn your, your stuff or they, they wash it away with water or it, it rains or something happens to it. Something's always happening to something. Whatever you get that's new, like something happens to it. Lighters, cigarettes, anything you leave, something's going to happen to it. That sucks too because in our life it's not about replacing our DVD player because it's broken and we have to have a new one or paying our cable bill or because you have to have cable it's we don't have all that stuff I was lucky to have a phone and not have it get stolen like and if all your stuff gets stolen all you have is the clothes on your back and you have to start all over again and it's like man <sighs> just that a lot of times while I was homeless I experienced some it's really small it's not that big a thing but if you see a homeless person and you're carrying leftovers of your food and like you see a homeless person and you know you're not going to really eat it, if you go up to them and hand it to them, it's going to make their day. You know, like, I mean, and it's good karma. That that was the thing that, that was just the most unreal is one time I got kicked out of a hotel with four people and we were sitting on the side of the roads with our bags and one lady pulled over handed us 20 bucks right and then seeing that we were freaking out because this chick just handed us 20 bucks oh my gosh we can all eat right and um, for like two days with 20 bucks you can make 20 bucks last two days on the street like if you really try if you know what you're doing with it but then she handed us 37 more dollars another lady I was at El Rio she handed me and Jordan 20 bucks my boyfriend Jordan and said um, go get your baby some diapers and we got him some wipes and we washed his clothes and we bought um, little baby food things for him and stuff. So, you know, like, not just money, just food. Like, it's crazy how, like, you paying your cable bill or you getting your $300 check every week can make you happy. But doing that for somebody who's sitting on the street, like, yeah, that's cool. That's the coolest thing that's ever happened is people just handing us food just out of just us.